I don't have faith, but you know, I don't expect them to do the right thing. I think things will be better under the new administration, but it's gonna take time. It went from this last awful administration that kind of shackled us and held us back on so many different levels. And I think the new administration has a lot of catching up to do. The vaccine rollout in the United States has drawn great public attention since it started on December 14th last year. U.S. President Joe Biden's national vaccination campaign aims to administer 100 million doses of two-stage coronavirus vaccines in his first 100 days in office. According to Johns Hopkins University, January has been by far the deadliest month of the pandemic in the country with over 95,000 COVID-19 deaths, surpassing December's total of over 77,000 deaths. And the spreading of multiple new coronavirus strains in the country has also increased the urgency to accelerate the pace of vaccinations. Biden said last month, while the vaccine provides so much hope, the rollout has been a dismal failure thus far. White House held a briefing earlier this week, announced plans to increase the supply of vaccines, though it would be limited in the beginning. Due to the current supply constraints, this will be limited when it begins next week. In this first phase of the program, supply will be at only about 6,500 stores nationwide before expanding. And in the early phase, many pharmacies across the country will not have vaccine or may have very limited supply. In this increasingly fierce fight against the pandemic, U.S. officials and experts are pinning their hopes on vaccines to let life return to normal. And let's hear about ordinary people's views on vaccination. Uh, yeah, I know people that appointments have been canceled because we've run out of uh, doses. Um, certain people who... I guess the public thinks should be a priority, aren't necessarily a priority. This, the infection rates are so high and it's traveling so quickly, I and mean, I don't think it's possible to keep up with the production of the vaccine. And so I think that's kind of where we're at at the moment. Um, my mother just got her vaccine at the last minute, and she said it was a little bit unorganized, and she hopes that it was stored right, because it seemed like it was like leftovers or something. That's how, that's how she felt. And this is a, ma a majority black neighborhood. And then we had a case where some places I saw in the news that, like uptown Washington Heights, in the school they were given um, vaccines, but nobody in the neighborhood knew. And it seemed like elite white people came to the hood to get vaccinated. So it does happen, unfortunately. So I think that we're behind schedule, or you know, it, regardless um, with everything that's going on. So I really think we need to. You know, just ramp up production. I don't know, enable the Defense Act, get as many people to produce these vaccines as possible and make it available to as many people as possible.